this. taking the school bus, Chloe. I know exactly what you mean, Sasha. I just hate how I look in yellow. <laughs> <laughs> Only took three years of savings and all of my birthday money since I was eight. <laughs> okay! Woo -hoo! Who can wait till this weekend, girls? <laughs> Not me! From night, here we come! Now remember, class, through history, artists have used a variety of mediums to express themselves. Van Gogh used paint and canvas. Mozart used music. Um, Gucci used fabric and scissors. Yes. Thank you, Jade. You're welcome. Now, class, here's the assignment. I want you to choose an artistic medium, any medium, and express yourself. The project you turn in should tell me who you are and what it's really like to be you. I express myself daily through my passion for fashion. Yeah! All right! You go, girl. Perhaps you should challenge yourself to find a new medium, Chloe. Can we work in groups, Mr. Del Rio? Yeah, we work best as a team. Hmm, all right. <laughs> as long as each person is equally represented, I don't see why not. Cool. We can work at my house. This will be a lot of fun. Oh, and the assignment is due first thing next week, and it's worth one quarter of your grade. Oh. Mr. Del Rio! No, no. But this is prom weekend, Mr. Del Rio. And the prom is our top priority. Can you give us an extension? Mm. Please, Mr. Del Rio. Well... My priorities are classroom activities, not after-school ones. I'm sure you'll find a way to make it work. isn't hip to is that this week, prom is what we're about. He's totally asking us to split focus. What's that smell? Uh-oh. It's the smell of disaster. Nah, that's Dylan's new body spray. Huh? Studliest. With a smell so strong, any girl is sure to hurl. You may sniff, but not touch, ladies. <laughs> Way to make an offer I can refuse, Dill. People, getting back to the crisis du jour? We've got a big project due in Mr. Del Rio's class, Cameron. 
and it's gonna rob us of valuable prom prep time. I don't know why y'all are freaking. I'm the leader of the prom committee, so I'm the one who's gotta hook the whole thing up. You ladies won't want to miss out on seeing my prom get up. Lucky for you, we're all going as a group, so you'll each get to have at least one dance with me. <laughs> we gotta focus, hot stuff. Ah. Now, there has to be a way to get out of this assignment. Why? Knowing you girls, you'll figure out how to do all your prom prep and ace the assignment. And if only we could find a way to make prom part of the assignment. But how? We could... Never mind. Hmm? Nah. What? It's nothing. Never mind. Mm. Spit it out, Yaz. Really, it's stupid. Okay, then, how about we... I was thinking we could make a video. That's a great idea. Really? Really? Yeah, that's a great idea. Too bad we don't have a video camera. Never fear, my funky fashion friends. You can get one from Kobe. Kobe knows everything about film and video. Then let's hit it, y'all. Time's a-wasting. <laughs> this is gonna be great. <laughs> We're gonna have the best project in class. Where's the video camera? I'm sure it's in here somewhere. Oh, man, we're gonna be late for third period, Bill. <clears throat> Hate to leave my girls, but oh, we've got to check. Ugh. Your girls? Who's what? I don't <gasps> think so. They're nobody's oh. girls. <laughs> Later, Jaden. Uh. Oh. I found the perfect camera for your project, girl. Uh, ladies. It's a simple point and shoot. This is gonna be styling. Thanks, Kobe. You're the best. Well, I do pride myself on knowing my way around the old AV room. Did you produce all these films, Kobe? Yep. I've worked on some of the greatest video projects this school's ever seen. Glee Club Reloaded, Stars in the Bleachers, Mr. Melman's Corner, the principal with principles. Whoops. Nap through that one. <laughs> now, I'm working on my best film ever. It's called... Thanks for the hookup, Kobe. But we gotta go. We're off to make magic. See you in the movies. Hmm. The history of cardboard. Recycling styles. A mega blockbuster for sure. I can already tell. This camera is going to dish us the best project in class. It looks like the style shout out is already dishing big time. Check the new column. Daily doings written by Anonymous. Ooh, mystery much? <gasps> About time. This paper has been crying out for a gossip column. Just give me the oh. scoops. Mr. Feeney is starting an after school tennis club. The science lab is getting a new shipment of beakers. The upper class parking lot will be expanded over the summer. Whoa. Anonymous sure got the scoop of the century with that one. Yonski. Daily dozings is more like it. Hope there's better stuff in tomorrow's column. Yeah. There's got to be more interesting stuff than this going down at Styles High. And I think it's coming into focus as we speak. Which one of you is ready for your close-up? I am. How do I look? Great. But you'd look better on the football field. The natural light will make you shine, girl. <laughs> I like the way you think. Chloe, but you can call me Angel, because that's what I am. Uh, oh? What else should I say? Any dreams, future plans? You know, cool secrets that tell all about the real you. Well, 
I'm all about expressing myself through my own personal style. A very flashy attitude. And most importantly, fashion. I love to paint and draw. I love to shop at the mall with my friends. I love school, though we do get way too much homework. What else? Oh yeah, I think there should be a bottled water machine in the cafeteria. And more mirrors in the girls' room. Who knows, maybe next year I'll run for student body president. I'll make that part of my platform. But I can't focus on that now, because this is a very important week. Prom is on Saturday. We've got a lot of work ahead if we want to do it in style. Hey, wait up! Now let's check in on Sasha and see how her prom preparations are coming along. Cool. Hey Sasha, got a minute to do huh? your on camera? It's time to record the deep thoughts of our prom committee chair. All right, uh, how do I start? Say whatever you want. This is your moment. Okay, well, I'm Sasha, but my friends call me Bunny Boo because I just love the hip hop thing. <laughs> But don't get me wrong, I dig all types of music. And I'm into kicking it with my butts. Which is why I volunteered to be the chairperson on this year's prom committee. Megan, tie these to the prom queen's throne. The prom theme I chose is formal funk. As you can see, I've got my team doing a bang up job, even setting up things for a kicking huh? DJ we hired. Never is organizing the refreshment table, and we've ordered mad food. Best Dana decorating the backdrops. We've got a professional fashion photographer who's going to come and take everyone's picture. This prom's gonna be off the hook. Let's hit it, guys. Hey, don't just throw those flowers around. They've gotta be arranged. Ooh. <laughs> Up. About time. <laughs> Action, pretty princess. Pretty princess is my nickname. My real name's Yasmin. I recently moved here, and I was really nervous about fitting in. But I feel like the luckiest girl in the world to have made the best friends ever. I love hanging out with Sasha, Chloe, and Jade. We have the coolest birthday parties together go on ski trips, come to think of it, we do just about everything together. I love to read, especially mystery novels. And you love to write. What's that you're printing out? Oh, this? It's just an assignment for English class. English class? We don't have an assignment, do I meant creative writing class. <gasps> There's the bell. Got a jam. Yeah. The next day, the girls are at the beach. Wide angle, sweeping shot of the sand, the surf, the horizon as we... Hey! Aren't you forgetting something? The stars of the movie? Your girlfriends? Uh, I was, uh, just getting an establishing shot. <laughs> well, establish yourself over here, will you? Wow, Chloe, you're really good. Thanks. Wait, let me try that again. Thank you, from the bottom of my heart. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> you ruined my shot. Sorry, cool cat, but Angel won't quit fronting. You don't have to prove it to groove it. I say if you got it, flaunt it. <laughs> I'm getting kind of nervous. We're doing great on our video project, but we don't even have our prom outfits picked out yet. <sighs> don't worry, we'll pull it off. 
<laughs> we always do. In fact, I've already picked my dress out and just have to find the perfect shoes. You're always the first one ready for everything, pretty princess. Ooh, and I think I just found mine. Look, isn't this all the funk? Now I know you're tweaked, girl. Even for you, that's a little over the top. Yeah, maybe you better go take a dip and cool off. I think your frontal fashion lobe's overheating. You really don't think I could work this outfit? Mm. Uh-uh. Hi, girls. Hi, Cameron. What took you guys so long? Three chili cheese dogs, tsunami fries, and a triple chocolate malt at the Surf Up drive through Hey, you guys want to go for a swim? Been there. Done that. Now we have to research prom gowns. Oh, we're just in time. What do you think uh -huh. of something like this? Hmm. You know, silk always rides up on me, and I don't have a handbag to match. Oh. <laughs> I mean, how do you think it'll look on me, you gomer? Hmm. I think it'll look really great, Chloe. Thank you, Cam. Good to know some boys at Styles High know style when they see it. Oh, yeah? Well, wait till you ladies see the wheels I'm working on for the prom. Wheels of your own, Dylan? They wouldn't by any chance be those training wheels you just took off your bike last week. <laughs> <laughs> Laugh if you will, ladies. On prom night, you'll be begging to ride with me in style. If y'all don't mind, no more prom talk. It's only the most stressful assignment I've ever taken on. Bunny boo hoo. You need cucumber slices, girl. I'm sorry, guys. This thing is just a lot more work than I expected. Ah, uh, a no stress eyeball salad. Now that's relaxing. Okay. Come on, Cam. I think this is our cue to leave. Have fun relaxing, girls. We will. And watch out for the shark still. <laughs> I'll do my best. <laughs> We should be filming, girls. The sunset will make our tans positively glow. If I do say so myself, the windblown look is awesome for my hair. If you don't say it, I will. I just hope I can recreate this style at the salon on Friday. <gasps> Chloe, look out! Everybody okay? I'm fine. Me too. Haven't had a ride like that since the screaming Meanie Coaster at Funland. Next time, Chloe, I'll be doing the driving. Oh, my car! I bet it's not as bad as it looks, Chloe. I don't know. It looks pretty bad. Hmm. <gasps> Come on, let's pick up our stuff. <laughs> Someone call the fashion police. <gasps> oh no! The camera! Chloe is gonna kill us! The way Chloe drives, maybe that won't be necessary. Hey! <sighs> Look out. It's not broken. Maybe we can rewind the tape and see what that was on the road. It came out of nowhere. I think it was a chihuahua. Um, guys, what, where are we? Oh. What's that sound? Little kitty. Are you okay, kitty? We gotta get out of here. Maybe we can push the car to a service station. 
We're too far from town. It would take us all night to push it. Uh, let's use Yasmin's cell phone and call Cameron. Maybe we could catch him before he leaves the beach. Oh, good idea. He knows all about cars. I bet he'll be able to fix it right up. Otherwise, we'll be riding bicycles to the prom. Mm. <laughs> Get Cameron on the phone now! Yes! It's working! Come here, you little precious. Would you like to come home and live with me, kitty? <gasps> okay, cool cat. I'm going to tell you something, and I don't want you to make any sudden movements. <laughs> Why? That's... Uh, it's not a cat. Uh... <laughs> ah! 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 <gasps> Good news, Cam's on the way. <gasps> Whoa! Uh, did someone get a hold of Dylan's body spray or what? Do you have to point that thing at me at this very moment, Yasmin? You're the one who said we've got to keep it real, Sasha. Doesn't get much more real than this. People who smell like skunk over on that side of the car. Some people get a little bossy when they're stressed out, but that's okay. This day has been very difficult. This day was fine until we had a car accident. <gasps> And it's all my fault. I ruined my car and almost hurt all of my friends. Angel, it, it was an accident. It could have happened to anyone, Chloe. Is everybody okay? We're fine! When we went down that embankment, I thought for sure I was a goner. And after we hit that tree, everything went black. And then I saw this beautiful bright white light. Hey, wow, what's that horrible smell? Mm. What I meant to say was, I uh, really like what you've done with your hair, Chloe. Uh. <gasps> Stop the tape! I can't have my public see me like this. Cameron, please say you can fix the car. Are you kidding? They haven't made the car yet that Cam can't fix. Man. That is some kind of smell. What happened out here? Yeah, this is no problem. I'm pretty sure I can fix her up before prom night. Now let's get you girls home. Therapy is the only solution. I still haven't found the right shoes. I am going to find the perfect prom dress if I have to try on everything at the mall. Not if I find it first. And we can't forget about new makeup, so Jade can give us all makeovers tomorrow night, right? Your fashion wish is my command. This is way bad. Come on! Hey, wait up! Did you guys see today's daily doings? Everybody else has. Has prom power player Sasha, that be you, huh? lost her grip on the biggest event of the year? What? Let me see that! Our sources tell daily doings that the prom purveyor is falling apart at the seams. I am not! And what sources? Jay, give it! Maybe she's even heading into full breakdown mode as the big night nears. <laughs> the prom looks to be the hottest night of the year. But will our chairperson put her own personal demons aside in time to enjoy the festivities? <gasps> I am not having 
a breakdown. Who's feeding them this trash? Okay, maybe I am stressing a little. But how does Daily Doings know that? Hi, guys. School's out. Off to the mall. We were, until I read this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we saw that. And, you know, you still seem kind of stressed. Sorry. Maybe you should go get a nice calming food court facial at the mall. <gasps> I think we better cool it, Dill. Somebody told Daily Doings about our private conversations at the beach. Hmm. Why are you staring at me? Who else could have told them what we talked about? What are you saying? Relax. Nobody takes that column seriously. Let's go. I can't oh. believe they did this. You guys know I'm only stressing because I'm trying to make the prom the best night of our lives, right? You're not really upset by that column, are you, Sasha? Nah, I guess not. I overreacted. Right. You're so way above this kind of thing. Yeah. You can't let a stupid column rattle you. You guys are right. There's no way I'm gonna let some anonymous wannabe news hound get to me. You know me better than that. Right. Now let's shop. <coughs> I still can't believe the guys would do that to me. I thought you said you were over that already. Cameron better have my car fixed by Saturday. If not, we better shop for some sensible heels. Why? Because I'm walking to the prom before I take that bus again. It's a party when the girls all get together. In the stores, at the movies, at the mall, and summer. Down at the beach, once we get Cool cat? It's prom, not Halloween. I just really want to make a splash with my prom outfit. Mm -mm. <laughs> you don't like it? Mm, don't think so. You think it's too much too? It's kind of like the one you picked out in the magazine at the beach. Am I losing my fashion sense? Hey, Jade, let's go ahead and shoot your segment for the video now. You're on. Okay. I'm Jade, AKA Cool Cat, you know. I'm really into cutting edge fashion. I love to take style risks and start new trends. Sometimes people think the outfits I put together are too out there. But my best friends have always supported my vision for hot new styles. Oh. That was great. Let me check it for sound. Sometimes people think the outfits I put together are too out there. But my best friends have it's always like... supported me. I'm beginning to doubt my own sense of fashion for the first time ever. Come on, you two. 
We're heading to the food court. We'll catch up. Yes. If I lost my fashion sense, it would be like losing my sense of vision, or my sense of smell, or touch, or taste. I mean, you guys depend on me for style tips and the hot new trends I find, right? Sure, but we like you because you're just a great friend. And this friend says you look like you could use a super yummy fruit smoothie. So hurry up and change. So yesterday we went to the mall for some serious shopping. Now we get to do some serious relaxing at one of our famous slumber parties. Hold up, Chloe. It's not the real deal until I start cranking the tune. Oh, it's totally hot. Just dropped yesterday. Yeah, uh-huh. This is the stuff right here. Show off those moves, girl. Ta-da! <laughs> now that is the beat for my close-up. <laughs> Gee, you were born to be a star. I'd like to thank all the people who made this possible, especially my amazing camerawoman, Chloe. Yeah, well, the amazing Chloe has lost all feeling in her wrist from holding up that camera. As usual, Jade has brought enough hair care products to make over the entire city. You're like a fashion superhero. Where there is dry scalp, where there are split ends, there you shall find me. Super hair care gal. Dum da dum! <laughs> Chips. You got girlfriends starving out here. All right, all right. Perfect guacamole doesn't just happen, you know. Um, Jade? I think you might lose your appetite when you read the latest daily doings. Why? You seem to be the star of today's scholastic scandal sheet. Has school fashion pioneer Jade taken a wrong turn on the style superhighway? Uh-oh. Here we go again. Inside sources confirm that on a recent mall crawl, the usually trendy Jade was seen trying on outfits that hinted to those in the know that she had become seriously fashion impaired. Oh no! I, who have been a fashion leader, am now considered a fallen fashion star. My worst nightmare is coming true. Jade, just... Try to stay calm. No one pays attention to this fluff. At least this means Cameron and Dill are off the hook. I mean, there's no way they could have known about them all. Then who blabbed? I can't believe this keeps happening. I come bearing food. Let the pajama party begin. Did you see this? No, but I hear it's become the hottest column in the paper's history. <sighs> You told me no one reads it! Uh, well... <gasps> I'll get it! Cameron! Uh, hey, Chloe. Listen, I gotta tell you something. Actually, I have something to say to you, too. Me first. Look. Dylan and I didn't have anything to do with that article in the Daily Doings yesterday. You gotta believe me. I do. There's no way we'd ever... <gasps> what, wait, what'd you say? We know it wasn't you guys. You do? How? Because Jade got trashed in today's edition, and there's no way you could have known about her losing her fashion sense. Hey! Sorry! Wow. I'm sorry I blamed you. Can you forgive me? Sure. It's okay. How's Jade taking it? Why don't you ask her? What's happening to me? Maybe I'm really coming down with something. Is there such thing as fashionitis? Uh... Ah! It's green! It's my guacamole. Oh. 
Look what the cat dragged in. Hi, Cameron. How you doing? Sorry I went after you so bad yesterday, Cam. Yeah, I guess it's someone else feeding the paper all these gossipy tidbits after all. I didn't realize you were all going to be here. I came to see Chloe. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, uh, nice jammies, girls. Uh, I came to tell you that your car is definitely going to be ready by prom night. Definitely. Cameron, that is awesome! Just in time! No more buses! We. You're the best, Cameron. Unfortunately, you're also the filthiest. And the scruffiest. You'll need the full makeover treatment. <laughs> what? We promise it won't hurt. Uh, wouldn't you girls rather work on each other? We give each other makeovers all the time. A boy makeover will be a great challenge. Let's go, girls. Uh, uh. <laughs> Hold still. Wow, you have seriously great skin. <laughs> Where are the tweezers? Let me out of here! What a night. I'll never forget the look on Cameron's face when he saw the makeover we gave him. <laughs> like the saying goes, a picture's worth a thousand words. Well, no more words here, please. I'm beat. Just say goodnight, everyone. Night. Good night. Turn that thing off and let's crash. <laughs> Good night, everyone. How do you turn it off? Oh, here. Check this out. Styles High Grease Monkey Primps for prom? <laughs> what was he thinking letting someone take his picture like this? His eyes were covered. My bet is he didn't even know. Ah! No, I mean it, Cam. Can you recommend a blush that'll bring out my eyes? Keep it up, Dill, and I'll bring out your eyes. Touchy. <laughs> Cameron, this... How did the paper get those pictures? We don't know, Cameron, but... <gasps> you and your friends were the only ones there. Cameron, I swear. And suddenly I'm the laughing stock of the school? Cameron, wait. Somebody should come pick up your car, because I'm not going to the prom. We were the only ones at my house last night. We had the camera. Are you accusing somebody? Because I don't appreciate being accused of stuff that I didn't do. I'm not accusing you. I'm just confused. Shh. The librarian's looking. <clears throat> Who took the camera this morning? I did. It's right here, but I didn't take it out of my bag all day. The shout-out came out first period. It wasn't me. I can't trust my friends. I can't trust my fashion sense. I can't trust anything anymore. <laughs> what do you think, Yasmin? Yeah, you're being awfully quiet. <sighs> What's wrong? Yeah, what is it? It's not like you're the one who just got slammed in the daily doings. 
It's not like you did either, Chloe. But Cameron blames me for that stupid picture of him, which is practically worse. Come to think of it, you've hardly been affected at all by this whole daily doings fiasco, Yasmin. And you knew about what I was going through with the prom prep. And you were the only one I confided in at the mall about feeling like I was losing my fashion sense. And you had access to the camera last night. You could have downloaded the pictures of Cameron when we were asleep. <sighs> Yasmin? The tape is gone! No way! What? Our assignment's gone? All that work. Uh, all right, all right, it was me! <gasps> what? I admit it! You were leaking stories about us to the Daily Doings mystery writer? Uh, worse. Huh? Yes, how could it be worse? I am the Daily Doings mystery writer. <gasps> if you girls can't stop talking, I'm going to have to ask you to leave the library. That's okay. We were just leaving anyway. I want to... Shh! <sighs> I can't wait till I get my car back. Yeah. Prom night won't be soon enough. Is anyone sitting here? Who wants gum? I do. Oh, me too. Hmm. <sighs> Ridiculous. We're at the spa. The one place in the whole world we always have fun. Our private beauty boot camp. Our mud pack makeover mecca. <sighs> and we're having a miserable time. Because Yasmin's not with us. <sighs> and the prom is gonna be even worse without her. We have to talk to her, guys. After all, we're the ones who said we wanted the school paper to print juicier stories. Right? And Yasmin sure delivered on that. <laughs> Got that right. <laughs> we were the talk of the school all week. <laughs> like the saying goes, who cares what they print as long as they spell our names right? <laughs> <gasps> Yasmin, we... Before you say anything, I want you to see this. Daily doings. Done. I'm not anonymous. I'm Yasmin. 
And I've hurt my best friends in the whole world by dishing and dissing them. You can read the rest in tomorrow's paper. Right now, I want to apologize in person. I'm sorry. When the column first came out and people thought it was boring, I wanted to spice it up. Then when everyone started talking about it, I felt important. Yes, men, you are important. To each of us. You're our friend. I didn't think those things were gonna hurt your feelings. I guess I got carried away and didn't think at all. Please forgive me. We forgive you. And we're sorry we said your column was boring. Totally. We're really glad you're here. Thank you, guys. And I'll never write another thing that I wouldn't be proud to put my name on. Oh, no! We forgot about Cameron. He was so upset. He's not even coming to the prom anymore. You've got to come clean with him, Yasmin. He's gonna hate me. He'll understand if you apologize and explain like you did with us. Cam's a really great guy. You're right. I'll tell him how sorry I am and convince him he just has to come to the prom with us. But before you go, I think you need to relax and beautify, girl. Okay, yes. He was totally cool about everything once I said how sorry I was. Give me that camera, Jade. It's time we girls hit the fashion runway. Fashion show! <laughs> Jade, the styled high fashion maven, has returned. <laughs> Who are you kidding? She never left. And you can print that. <laughs> <laughs> That's them. Come on. We're right behind you. Whoa. Holy guacamole. Chloe's car! Oh, way to go, Cameron! This is gonna be the best night ever! <laughs> <laughs> you gave my car a makeover! Woohoo! <laughs> wow. <clears throat> Yasmin apologized about the daily doings. Now it's my turn. I'm sorry I blamed you. It's okay. You were upset. You look great, Chloe. So do you. Huh? <laughs> and so do you! Great job, Cameron. It's totally cool. Wow! Oh. Oh. Ordered the stretch! Did I tell you or did I tell you? Style on wheels. You guys look amazing. Thanks. Kobe, I hope you're ready for your big break. 
because we want you <sighs> to film us dancing the night away. All right, no problem. Come on, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Prom night. Here we come. Everybody, we have to make the coolest entrance Styles High has ever seen. Yeah, this is our moment to shine. Are you ready? Lead the way, ladies. Sasha, the photographer called. He's quitting the photo business to become a painter. He said sorry. What? Oh, no. Sorry don't cut it. Where's DJ Chip Chop? In bed with the flu. <sighs> the caterers, did they cancel too? Nope. Oh, thank goodness. They're stuck in traffic and won't be here for two hours. <gasps> oh, man. Looks like your column got one thing right, Yasmin. This prom is sad. No way! My column was wrong! We're gonna take care of this, girls. Our camera can take digital stills for the prom pictures. Chloe, you and Cody, go! And a party's not a party without some of my famous chips and guacamole, right? Food run? We'll take the limo. I'll fire up the disco ball and fill the dance floor with balloons. You, you, and you, come with me. And Sasha, who are you kidding? You never go anywhere without your music. I've got the perfect beats in my locker. <laughs> with those pizzas. <laughs> Woo! This do-it-yourself prom gig turned out all right. Sure did. The party's super slamming. And all the votes for prom king and queen have been counted. Get ready. So you're the infamous anonymous, huh, Yasmin? I was, but that's all behind me. So, not planning any more articles? Well, actually, I do have one more scoop. Style students save prom in style. Has a ring to it, don't you think? Hello! Uh, if I may have your attention, students. I guess I've already got it. Well, it's the moment we've all been waiting for. Time to crown the prom king and queen of Styles High. Your votes have been tallied, and your prom king is Dylan. Well, fellow stylites. 
I have always known that I was destined for truly great things. And I now look forward to serving you as your king. And your prom queen is... Jane! If you still think you've lost your fashion sense, no one else at Styles High does. You like me. You really like me. I bet you've dreamed of this moment, haven't you, Jade? Being crowned my prom queen? <laughs> What are you talking about, your prom queen? Dill, I suggest you take my arm right now before I knock that crown right off your big head. <laughs> I meant, what? What's the best part? <laughs> Noticing new things about old friends and learning to appreciate what was always there. Uh, that's cool. That includes you. I really like that we're getting to know each other better. And I'm so glad that you decided to come to the prom after all. Me too. Do you want to dance? You bet. Kobe, get out of here. And so ends perhaps the greatest film Styles High has ever produced. The road to the prom has been a bumpy one, but it was a road paved with dreams. Oh, forget it. I always wanted to be an actor anyway. Principal Melman, I need you to film me partying with my friends. Uh, well, uh, sure, Kobe. Night. Way to go, Sasha, Miss Prom Committee. Oh, thanks. But it took everyone chipping in to make prom night the bomb. I'm so glad to have funky friends like you. Now, how does it feel to be basking in the presence of a prom queen? It royally rules, your highness. Hey, girls, express yourself. certainly have taken a very original approach to my art assignment. And I, for one, loved it. <laughs> it was original, captivating, stylized, and told me so much about each one of you you're all getting A pluses.